These are the largest helicopters in the world. They're tough enough to withstand the harshest conditions, are so advanced they can locate hidden submarines underwater, strong enough to carry heavy loads, and are so stealthy they can go unnoticed until it's too late. Here are the 10 largest and deadliest helicopters ever. Welcome to Explained. Let's start with the smallest helicopter at number 10, the NH-90. This helicopter is an absolute beast. And it comes in two variants, the specially designed NATO frigate helicopter and the tactical transport helicopter. The NATO frigate's version can defend itself against ships with its anti-surface warfare systems. But what's even cooler is its anti-submarine warfare systems. And when this device is lowered into open water, it can detect quiet enemy submarines hiding under the surface. It's also got safety features like a harpoon deck lock system, and it's got flotation gear in case of a water landing. On the other hand, the tactical transport version is for missions over land. Its body is armour-plated, so it can easily take on firing from small arms. And its other defence features include laser and radar warning receivers, a missile launch detection system, and flare dispensers. The NH-90 is capable of carrying 20 fully equipped troops, or 20 stretchers during an evacuation mission. can take off weighing as much as two African elephants. More importantly, the NH-90 is stealthy. It has the lowest radar signature in its class thanks to its diamond shape and full composite airframe. That combined with infrared suppressors, night vision and vertical engine air intake, and it becomes quiet and undetectable till it's too late. At number nine is the V-22 Osprey. What do you get when you combine the vertical power of a helicopter with the speed and range of a plane? You get the V-22 Osprey. This chopper is unlike any other combat aircraft. When its rotors are vertical, it can take off, hover and land like a helicopter. But once it's airborne, it converts to a turboprop airplane that's capable of high speed and high altitude flights. It can even refuel in mid-air and when it's not in use, it can fold up and stow away. To protect itself, it's armed with an interim defensive weapon system, which is basically a 7.62mm minigun on its belly. It can carry 24 troops, or small weapons, light vehicles and supplies and it's been used for military operations around the world, including Iraq, as well as for humanitarian missions in Haiti and Nepal. At number eight is the EC-725 Caracal. This helicopter is used for combat search and rescue missions, cargo transport and casualty evacuation. But missions like this are dangerous. So to protect itself, it has flare dispensers and infrared suppressors that keep it undetected. But if it comes under fire, its outer armour will protect it against small firearms. When it comes to attacking, it can be fitted with 7.62mm machine guns and side-mounted rocket pods. The EC-725 is large and very intimidating. That's as heavy as three African hippos. This chopper was specially designed for the French Air Force. It can carry 28 troops behind enemy lines, and if it needs to travel long distances, it's capable of refueling in mid-air as well. The seventh largest on our list is the Augusta Westland AW101. This helicopter isn't just large, it's powerful and it's capable of intelligence gathering, anti-submarine warfare and surface warfare as well. At sea, it can take down a submarine by launching torpedoes and it has anti-ship missiles as well as crew-controlled machine guns.
That's the equivalent of three T-Rexes. The AW101 is equally capable over land and can carry 25 to 45 troops and artillery and tactical ATVs. It's got a full ice protection system for cold weather missions, a terrain awareness and warning system, military friend or foe identification and air-to-air -air refueling capabilities. If it comes under attack, it can retaliate with air-to-surface missiles for some serious damage. And fun fact, this helicopter was used in James Bond's Skyfall in 2012. At number 6 is the Shanghai Z-18. This large and powerful military transport helicopter was built by China. And what really makes the Z-18 a threat is its ability to take on high-altitude missions with ease. In fact, during a test flight, it broke a record by attaining an altitude of 9,000 metres, making it one of the few helicopters of its size to fly above Mount Everest. It's also fitted with cool technology, like a nose-mounted weather radar and FLIR TV turret. When it comes to maritime missions, it can only operate from the largest naval vessels. And that's as heavy as 28 grand pianos. Rounding up, our top five is the Aerospatiale SA321 Super Freelon. The SA321 is deadly. One of its craziest features is its ability to carry eight 250 kilogram mines for mine laying missions. But it doesn't just set them up, it can also detect them with its mine sweeping countermeasure system. This chopper can also throw a punch with its 20 mm cannon, four homing torpedoes, and two Exocet anti ship missiles. In terms of size, the SA321 is a giant. That's as much as two T-Rexes. With features like night vision and a personal locator system that helps find soldiers in poor weather conditions, it's a huge asset during search and rescue missions. In fact, this chopper is such an all-rounder, it's used by many of the world's air forces like China, France and South Africa. Let's enter the monster category with number four, the Milmi 38. Whether it's oil exploration, heavy lifting or VIP transport, the Mi-38 is prepared for any operation. It can take on the harshest environments and can withstand temperatures from minus 60 degrees Celsius to over 50 degrees Celsius. For missions in Arctic conditions, its rotor blades are fitted with a de-icing system. If it's on a surveillance mission, the floor of the chopper can be fitted with cameras and other sensors. And when it's on an offshore oil exploration mission, it's prepped with equipment for an emergency landing in water. The technology on this chopper is insane, but just how big is it? That's as much as three African elephants. It can carry 30 passengers, but its design inside can be modified to accommodate 16 stretchers or even cargo transportation. At number three is the Boeing CH-47F Chinook. This bad boy was developed specially for the US Army and is used by other militaries as well. The Chinook takes part in any operation that involves transportation of troops, war supplies and battlefield equipment from place to place. But what really sets this chopper apart is its digital automatic flight control system. And what it does is it helps pilots hover in place or land in situations with extremely poor visibility like brownouts in the desert. But its abilities don't stop there. The Chinook is armed with three 7.62mm machine guns. Some even have long range fuel tanks and infrared countermeasure systems as well. This helicopter is so huge it takes two pilots and a flight engineer to operate it. It's a whopping 30 meters in length and has a maximum takeoff weight of 22.6 tons, which is like taking off whilst carrying an AMX-13 tank. But 
don't be fooled by its size. It can fly at 302 km per hour, making it faster than many utility and attack choppers. And it can carry 55 passengers, or fewer passengers with light vehicles and artillery vehicles inside, or even sling loads on the outside. At number two is the Sikorsky CH-53K King Stallion. This is the heaviest and largest helicopter in the US military. To give you some perspective, it's more than half the size of a C-17 Globemaster III aircraft. But don't take our word for it. Here are the facts. Its length is 30 meters, which is similar to the Chinook, but it takes the number two position because it has a maximum speed of 321 kilometers per hour. Its takeoff weight is almost 40 tons. That's as heavy as three AMX-13 tanks. The CH-53K King Stallion specializes in carrying large cargo or troops from ship to shore, and it can do this in just a few trips. It's got lightweight ballistic protection, three 12.7 mm machine guns, as well as a chaff and flare dispensers. And like some of the other choppers in our list, the CH-53K is also capable of air-to-air -air refueling. Finally, at number one is the Milmi 26. The Milmi 26 is the largest and most powerful helicopter in the world. It's 40 meters in length and has a speed of 295 kilometers per hour. This monster is literally capable of carrying an aircraft and it can comfortably lift up the Chinook as well. Its takeoff weight is 56 tons. That's the equivalent of six T-Rexes. On the inside, its cargo area is 12 meters long and 3.2 meters wide. And it has a ceiling height of 2.9 meters. That's about the same load capacity of a C-130, which is one of the largest planes in the world. It's got enough room to see 80 to 150 battle-ready troops and it can hold two large combat vehicles weighing 9,988 kilograms each. But the Mil Mi 26 isn't just built for heavy lifting. It's also capable of electronic warfare, disaster relief tasks for nuclear accidents, and treating victims of medical evacuations in its flying operating room. Which is the coolest helicopter in your opinion? How much bigger do you think they'll get? Tell us about it in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe to Explained.